So you, these books came out, the, the three books in a row, boom, 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 and that was yes. and it worked obviously very well. Yes. <laughs> and, but even before they came out, they were out in galleys and people like mm -hmm. Scott Rudin and producers and all these people in Hollywood and, and uh, pay attention and they hear about hot properties or whatever, and your books got optioned even before the first one was published. Yes. By yes. the one person in the world you would like to have optioned your books. Yeah, you know, and uh, I, can't, I can't really talk about it at all right now, sorry. Oh, okay. Well, you know, because it's, uh, I'm sure at some point you've, you've, you've learned, as, it, as I'm sure you knew, there's nothing more expensive one can do in Hollywood than, like, be on the water <laughs> and fantasy. And so you're, like, on the water in fantasy in a period. To, yes, it's like, exactly. You've no, literally no, made the right. worst possible, most expensive right. thing. It'll be a lovely $400 million film. Thank you very much. Right. right. Yeah, so that was no, a decade. No, well, it's interesting. You know, I, I very much hope Tamarera will make it to the screen at some point in some form. Some screen. Um, yes. Who knows what kind of You know, screen. who knows. Um, and we just have to see. You know, the wonderful thing is technology is becoming better. Technology is improving and um, the things that are possible now um, are were not possible 10 years ago mm -hmm. um, and were unimaginable 10 years before that, you know. So, um, so I'm really excited to see. I, I hope it makes it there. I'm not, you know, we'll see what happens.